Hi guys, Mr. Sontag here. Today I wanna to show you our functional ear training game and I'm gonna walk you through it a little bit remotely. So stay tuned at home. We got 20 questions. We're gonna do C major, many octaves, okay? You guys have done this before and I know you guys are super good at it. So let's give it a shot. Let's hit play. Now remember, you're gonna hear four chords at the beginning. One, four, dominant five, back to one. And then you're gonna hear that one note. And this one, if you're thinking, mm, la, ti, do, you'd be absolutely correct. Let's see what we have next. Now, for this at whole activity, you need to be able to really train your ear to hear, do, and that is exactly what you hear on this one. So if you were thinking it was number one or do, you'd be correct. Let's see what we have next. I want you to try and figure this one out. If you were thinking so, that's correct. Number five for so. Now, this one's a little bit tricky. You hear a little bit of tension when you hear this note. You hear... Does it want to go up or down to get to do? So it's... It went down, so it must be number two, so we can resolve down to number one. Listen again. Mm -hmm. Number two, Ray. Mm -hmm. So it helps to be able to hear do, la, ti, do. And so for this one, you can hear that note. Where does it go? It goes up to do, so it's only two notes away from do. La, ti, do. If you were thinking la, number do, re, mi, fa, so, la. Number six, you got it. Oh, and this is so low. This is why we did C major in many octaves, to give you a little bit of a challenge. Now this one is so low. During some of these lower notes, it's hard to hear the exact note, but. I'm gonna try and sing that. I can't sing that low. It's a secret. Yes. Fa is number, what number is it? Good, and notice how it walked down to fa. Again, does this note want to go up to do or down to do? And let's listen. It wants to go up. It's only a half step, the smallest increment in music away. And here's that half step. It just wants to go right up to do every time. Let's hear. Oh, they gave it to us again, but in a different octave. Did you guys notice that? It's the same note, but in a different octave. Let's listen again. It wants to go up by one note. So we're looking at number seven. Here we go. Now it helps me to think of do. So I have. You ever watch Wizard of Oz? It goes like this. Oh, oh, we, oh, oh. That's what I always remember to help me remember a perfect fit. So. In this game, you hear so la ti do. So is always number five. That's a dominant. Perfect. Let's keep going. How many notes away is it? Think. Good. We got it. Number six. La. two ways you can think of or so what note is it so if you thought so you are so correct good job oh 
Oh, I don't like those low notes. That's pretty tricky. Let's hear it again. You know what? Luckily, I think they gave us dough. Let's see. Yes, it was dough. Very nice. Real dough. Oh, the first time we've gotten this one on this test. Here it is. Figaro, Figaro, Figaro. Right? When you hear this note, the third note. Three, two, one. Me. Figaro, Figaro, Figaro. I think they gave him. I wonder what note it is. Number three, me again. They tried to trick us, huh? And this is low again, so it's hard to hear, but you're going to hear this. It helps me to sing it a little bit higher in my comfortable singing range. Fa, number four for fa, mi, re, do. Let's see, only a few more questions here on this test. Again, does it want to go up or down to do? And I tell you this because if you try it, doesn't sound like do in this key. Wants to go down, and it's only one step away, so it's re, do. Got it, number two for re. Very nice, guys, you're almost there at 100%. Let's do it. Do you hear that? Try it again. I think high, think high, think high. Sounds like the tonic of the key. This is do. Very nice. It's super high. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna think as even though it's lower, it's T Do. It wants to go up to Do to resolve, to give us that smooth balance and resolution. So here it is. Number seven is T. It's right next to Do. And T. They tried to trick us by making it so low in the in the register, but here it is. T Do. Very nice. Only two more questions. You guys are doing great. Keep it up. Okay, again, down low in the register, it's very hard to hear, but you hear a lot of tension there. It wants to go down to do. When you hear these four chords, it gives you it gives you the harmony that you need to hear do. But then they give you this note. That note sounds kind of angry and tense. So it needs to go down ray right down to do to give you a nice smooth resolution. Re do. Last one. And they, they try to give us the same note, but in a higher octave to trick us. But they can't trick us, can we? We are too smart. Here it is, our last question of the quiz. Sometimes it helps to sing it in the uh, higher register, but I always try to keep it a nice, comfortable tone for me. So number two is re. And there you go. We just got 100% on our functional ear training. You guys did a great job. I'll see you again very soon. Thanks for uh, singing with me.